All right, the map is Seaport, and these are the bonuses, 3, 4, 6, 2, 7, 5, 2, and 2. And we're the yellow player, second in the turn order. And this wizard makes into a 1, 2, 3, 4 point hold for the docks, and a 1, 2 point hold if you clear out this part of the wharf, which only connects over to here, not down to here. Wharf is a 1, 2, 3 point hold, unaffected by the blizzards. This is a 2 point hold, unaffected by the blizzard. This blizzard makes into a 2 point hold. Okay, so you are, did you just grab a round 1 bonus there, Black Lair? I think you might have, it's only plus 2 though. The Pirate Fleet, because of this blizzard, is a 1, uh, 2, 3 point hold. You can also hold this bonus here on a 3 point hold for plus 9. This is a 2 point hold for that. Did you start that bonus? I don't think you did. So what do I want to do here? You're weak here, I think. Don't know that I want to fight you. Uh, Magenta has a 5 here. I don't feel like attacking through that. You got a 3 here. I don't feel like dealing with that. Uh, can I get a bonus here? This is a 4 uh, point hold for plus 4. 3 point hold for plus 3, but I'm not strong. Everything I have is over here, but Magenta's in my way. I need Magenta to move. Maybe, do I, do I want to hit the black player and break their spirits? Make sure they don't have that bonus? Or do I attack? I, I need Magenta to get out of my way. That's what I need. But I need to get a card somewhere, and I don't want to attack Magenta. I don't want you having this bonus well before everybody else has theirs. So let's do that and fortify this over to here. And we need to see, wait and see what Magenta does. We've made a per probably a permanent enemy out of the black player. If we're lucky, they just bought out and leave and don't revenge grudge match me. Well, they probably uh, do stick around and... I mean, ideal scenario, they like just pivot and play somewhere else on the board, right? You know, go for this, right? You didn't spend that many trips over here. Three, right? And I could actually go for this bonus and just block you from having this. I would like to see the magenta player move or give me something. I can't really go this way through you. I would... I'd be spending troops just to help Magenta get their bonus quicker. Why do I want to do that, right? What is Magenta going to do? It's up to you. Blue has got a 5 here and 9 here. How many do we start on the board with? Like 25 or so, maybe? Not sure. I see 12 of yours, so you're strong over here. Heck that. Okay, good. So the blue player is going for this plus 4 on a 4 point hold. We ignore that. We work on getting my troops out of there if I can. Maybe we fortify this 3 over to here so that 4 can attack through and get to where you want it. And then once you leave that spot behind, I can attack here, fortify into here, and get stronger over for the docks here. What am I going up for this? We got nothing up there. So we're just kind of forced. When you when you got all your troops in the middle, you're either going for the docks, the wharf, or this. Oh, please don't attack a 10v7. You might. They're saying good game. Why? Do you think that they have this? What do you... They stacked over here, and then they're attacking somewhere else. So... I'm thinking that they're they're signaling that they want this, which makes sense. Where are they going to go to over here? They're doing a lot of attacking. Are they slow rolling something? Attacking on like crazy somewhere. There, oh, they attacked through over here. Okay. I see, I see what's happening over here. You're going to hit my seven, aren't you? You're going to hit my seven, aren't you? Yeah, you are. You're, 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 you're thinking about it? Or you're, you're, you're thinking about it? No, you attacked somebody over there and lost three, so you're ten becomes a six because you leave one behind and now you, so you're going over here okay we know what you're up to you're rolling over this way and the black player so now i have the magenta who's clearly coming through to slam my six the black player did in fact bot out so they're not holding like a grudge against us uh, what do i do about you per se i can't go for, like I, w I would love to just like leave you be for this and switch over here but i can't um, you are going to use the full attacker's bonus on my... If I stack here, it's 9. You're going to stack 3 there, have an 11, bam, bam. I could stack 9 and do as much damage to you as I can before you come and take it out. I attack you with a 10 from behind. Because clearly, you are signaling that you are going to destroy my 7 troops over there. That is far too substantial to have happen. I need to, uh, slow roll this and get lucky. Okay, that's a good start. All right. Is it up above 50%? No, it's not. We try again. Give me the dice. Again, not quite what I'm looking for. We're looking to get that above 50%. Come on. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Above 50%. Come on. There we go. And just like that, you are out of there. And we move this over uh, to here to defend against you. I don't expect to hold the wharf. Red might break it. They might come in through here. The, the bot might play something to get here. My concern now is dealing with Magenta. Because they, they they forced me to take a fight that I didn't want. Luckily, I think we got fairly good dice. Um, we had... I mean, we had a 7 and a 6, which was 13. Now we're down to like a 10. So, I mean, it was 
yeah, I, I, actually, it was a, before I attacked him, it was a 10 here and a 10, and a, 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 there's a 10 here and a 6 here. So if I had, you know, I could have had a 10 here, a 6 here, and this hits, well, gotta get a card somewhere. 10 hits a 3 for card, I don't know, but overall, we could have had, like, maybe 30 troops, but the fact that Magenta is now a lot weaker, and if they want to, like, retaliate, they gotta try and push through a 10, we're in a better situation. As opposed to Magenta basically bullying me out of here, slamming seven of my troops, and then I'm trying to, like, push through a three to get this, a turn after you already have yours. I think this is kind of our best situation. Blue starts with seven troops, means they have their plus four, okay? And they attack, they tried to attack into here to either break or get a card. The bots, okay, and you get three. You stack them all right here, and you're gonna slow, you're gonna slow roll and hope you get lucky, aren't you? You're gonna slow roll and hope to get lucky. To be fair, you forced my hand to retaliate against you like this. You're gonna, you're thinking about that slow roll, right? Or you could try and attack somewhere else. You got a one there, a two there. You can't have much troops. You can't have much troops across the board. You pushed through all of this. You had a bunch there. Yeah. When well, you fortify away, interesting, interesting. You fortify one away. Are you even a, are you even a player? No, you're a bot. Okay, you're a bot. That's fantastic. Um, the bots, the the. The black player who bought it out. So I, I broke the black player and they bought it out. I smashed the, the magenta player. They bought it out. I've already forced two players to bot out. I don't like the bot fortifying next to me over there. All right. What if I just ignored? I got five there. What if I ignored the bot over here and then went for this? Well, blue. There's a lot. I mean, it is a. I mean, it's. I could just stack here. Uh, I just rather just focus over here. Hmm, I don't know if I want to try and get the docks yet. There's a lot of stuff going on around there. I mean, I do have stuff over here to work over. What if we slapped one troop over to there to hit that, give this seven to hit that, and act like we're getting out of blues way, which we kind of effectively are. We hit this like so. Um, don't put them all over like that. And we fortify these down to here, and now... We have, you know, cleared some of my troops into a, a more useful area. We got a three block in this, three block in this. There's a good chance the bot stacks here and slaps that three. But we have red out of here. We got three protecting this. And tens over here, slowing down magenta, right? And maybe this is going to be okay for us. Unless red wants to retaliate for that three. No, they're going over this way. And attacking magenta bits. Not sure I hit there than there. What was the play there? You did, you're moving pretty quickly. I'm trying to set your bonus. Did you even have anything? No. Blue was the first one to hold a bonus, I think. You lost three there. What are you doing? Are you just attacking out all your troops on blue? Did red just give up? Did red just give up and just attack out all their troops on blue because they're upset at blue? Is it just down to like the only players left in the match are gonna be myself and blue? That that seemed like I'm that seemed like a I'm self-destructing and giving up turn from you. Blue is gonna be the strongest of the board, so they didn't really have to fight anybody for their plus four. But if they don't realize how strong I am yet and don't really mess with me, it might be in a good situation. Yeah, if, they're, if they play it slow, not realizing that I'm holding two bonuses right now, that could be good for us. Um, I just need to keep stacking enough here to keep the Magenta bot off my back. Hopefully the bot doesn't keep stacking a bunch here. Come on, no, the bot, the bot wants this bonus, unfortunately. I'm going to need to deal with the bot, but Blue is still here. And I don't know if Red's botted out yet or not. The Magenta bot did not even get a card. Okay, which means you're probably viable for elimination soon. Um, wait, well, that means I don't have to worry about you. Oh, you're gonna cut out oh, the bot. Okay, this bot breaks me. That's unlucky, but we still get a plus two from the wharf. Um, what do I do about the bots? Uh, what do I do about the bot over here? Hmm. Do I just attack you out right now and go for this bonus? Yeah, I think that's what we do. I mean, we'll feed the kill on the bot to somebody else, but it's better than having the bot stack three here every turn, preventing me from doing things elsewhere. I need you to not be over here. And I can begin this bonus, too. Should have done this sooner, I think. Um, we leave the bots sitting there. That's fine. We abandon holding the docks for now. And we pivot over to having this plus four. It's not as good as having the docks, but what it does is it... It gets magenta off my back, so I'm not having to stack three here or more every turn to deal with you. Red did not bot out, good to know, but they are low on troops. But that's good, so maybe red and blue keep each other busy. Red does take their actions quickly, so they are clearly not a complete novice at the game. A threat to be worried about. 
If I can wait a turn or two, I can maybe even, you know, wait a second. I've got a kill guard in the bots. There's a blizzard there. They can't go through there. Also, if I take this, nobody ever holds a pirate head. I didn't even realize that this blocked it. Yeah, yeah. So my assessment of the blizzard at the start of the match was incorrect. Blue's going to be way ahead on troops. They've they've been holding four for a while, and they've not been having to go to war like I have, unless Red did much damage to them. So, I mean, I've got 25, which is what I started with, even though I had this most few turns. So we are probably, I'd say, I wouldn't be surprised if we we're like 15 troops behind Blue. We need to hold this for a while and eventually get the docks here to really start to kind of recover a bit. They are taking their entire turn, which means they probably took a bathroom break. There they go. Yeah, they probably just got back from bathroom break. Gonna hit my two. Ooh, look how quickly they... Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Blues. Blues played the game. They take their actions pretty quickly there. Blues not some novice. The bot stack three right there. Does that mean that red pushed you out? Um. Hmm. I could wait till the card value gets bigger and take you out, or just take you out and have something else to do with you. If I take you out, I don't have to defend here, actually. The bot wants to go in here, unfortunately. The bot wants the docks. Oh, brother, I forgot. I gotta protect that. Unlucky, we still get this plus two. I can actually hit the bot here. If I'm lucky, that's the last thing the bot has. I can... I mean, we hit this just to have a one-point hold over here. And then we work over here. We have a two-point hold on all this. I wish I didn't realize that sooner. I would have taken the bot out quicker, right? All right, this uh, guarantee takes that out. Um, we don't worry about getting the docks back this turn, unfortunately. We just have to deal with it for now. And kind of like recover. If I'm lucky, this is the last you have, and we get a kill here in the bot. Unlucky, lost three. Oof, man. Really unlucky there, but we now have a one point hold on plus two. Soon to have a two point hold on a lot more. And I'm hoping that red and blue will keep each other busy. Bit of a rough match. If I had assessed sooner what was going on over here and realized that this was a one point hold here, I would have taken the bot out quicker and then with you know had to spend less troops dealing with the bots and could have fortified this better. But hey, I think I think I played this map maybe like once or twice before, and it was a while ago, so brushing up my memory and you know, pay attention rights. But yeah, we're figuring it out. We're doing alright. We're a little bit low on the troops. So we got 22 had to do a lot of damage we fed the we're gonna feed the bot kill to somebody else this bot's going to us i basically i basically i dealt with the black player and the and the magenta player back to back and then after i did that i had to thus and i'm also dealing with their the spirits of their remnants left behind the bots well blue and red are just kind of getting away with everything over here blue just got to free this red worked a little bit more aggressively to get this but they did get it the question is are they funny each other also how much did you start with seven they started with six so as far as I know, unless you guys have broken each other, red's holding this, blue's holding this. If you guys are being buddy, buddy, friendly, friendly with each other, it's not great for me. Magenta's attacking across the board, and they'll actually get a card. If only you had done that last turn of says stacking with me. You guys will farm the, that bot for cards. My winning scenario here is to bide my time for several turns to recover my troops, while you guys hopefully attack each other a lot. I would like to get and hold. Okay, that's actually good that you've been stacking there. Yeah, that's fine. And we just card trade in. Ooh, look at the cannons. They look neat. Oh, it's my turn. Okay, we started with uh, five. Click that at a weird time. All right, we want... Um, yeah, don't use the wild card. I like the visuals in these cards. It's neat. I like how they did different cards for the map. These all go here. We are going to... Oh, hit this. Let's leave uh, the bots. My, let's, let's leave... I can always fortify back, right? How much I want over there. Get this hold this and nobody knows about it except for the bot let's keep it strong over here because the bot's got five there and just hope the bot doesn't if the bot really is determined to screw me over it will it'll it, it, it'll get a card trade of i don't know, like ooh, oh boy it's gonna have a card if a card trades on three i'm in trouble if this bot wants to screw me over again it will you card trade for eight you started with three troops, which means the blue player broke you, or Magenta broke you. But you take out Magenta for three cards, gives you another card trade, which is unfortunate. And we'll say well played as well, because that gives you... I knew it was feeding the kill of somebody else. I was hoping they killed before they got a third card, but... You getting stronger is actually good, because I think you're going to be busy with blue. You're not going to want to push through black to fight me when you've got blue on your border. You're probably going to try and... Maybe you're going to try it for this. No, I don't know. Or maybe you want some... I don't know. I don't know what your plan is. Hopefully you're just you're you're you might be doing the same thing as me, just trying to sit back and recover a little bit. 
Seven for... Okay, you didn't break blue, all right? Blue's just been sitting back. Blue's gotta have probably... Like, Blue's gotta have like 60 or 70 troops right now. Blue's gonna be very strong. If I'm lucky, what they're doing is stacking like, you know, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15 to protect themselves. And they don't have a kill stack to like go for me. I think if the blue player had one big kill stack, they could run through and take me out this turn for the kill. But they don't have that knowledge. That's where my advantage lies. Um, if I'm lucky, they're fighting red there. Plus five for you means the uh, the black bot does have this plus two. Um, no card trade on three. You stacked all five right there. Attack here, because that's where you're card trading with blue. They lost four. Great. Great. Love this. Love this. Love this. I love that you only have a two there now. Attacked a few times. Bot fortifies back and wants to protect its bonus. 13 troops for us is going to draw their attention. Do I card trade in three here for safety? Don't know that I need to. Uh, makes the bot stronger. Let's do... Just a lot more over here, and in case the bot wants to go down here, but it does seem like the bot mostly wants to be up here. Do I hit the four? I mean, either way, I attack blue sees if they have this here. Ah, uh, just just hit the two, save my troops. Yeah, although like getting that four weaker does sound nice. Okay, no, now 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 blue knows what I've got going on over here. Unfortunate, but I don't know that they're in a position to do much about it. I don't know that you're in a position to do a lot about it. Because what you can, this won't roll through there. Once you have a big stack right here, I guess they could go around like this. Depends if they have an Omega stack somewhere. Red taking their turns very quickly. I think Red is a pretty experienced player. They only started with three troops, though. They're an experienced player, but I think they got a little bit unlucky. And I think Blue and Red... Oh, okay, both these... Both, uh, red and Blue both got to be at least intermediates, I think. Or, I don't know, like... Just, uh, they've definitely played the in bunch. They take their actions quickly. But now I'm getting a... What was it, plus 13? Ooh, big car trade bot. Oh, no. 16. Please don't take a 16 v 17 bot. Please don't take a 16 v 17 bot. Have that 16 attack down there. Don't do it. Leave me alone. Okay, they attacked up there. That's fine. Attacks. Oh, that. Wait, did that. Wait, 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 wait. That. What, did you just break blue? Or did you attack it and fail? I think the bot. Did the bot just break blue? All right, you bot are looking a little bit scary. But you're not going to. You don't have another car trade, so we're okay. I'll hit down here for card. Put those there. I need to keep that real strong up there. Bot is really scaring me here, but I'm getting the biggest bonus right now. I'm I'm happy to chill. Fortify this over into here. I'm in a two point hold, holding nearly half the board and blocking anybody from having the pirates bay. And this is a uh, this over here is a plus six. That's hard to hold. I'll never let them hold it. Plus twenty for you. You started with three troops. You've not reclaimed your bonus. I think the red player is probably the lowest on troops. What did I get last turn? I got 13. We're getting plus 13 a turn. We're doing very nicely. I do probably need like two or three more turns of this to um, really uh, catch up to blue. Unless blue and red have been fighting a lot more, I think. Oh, plus three. The bot did break you, right? That's fine. Or maybe you and red are going to war. This is great. This is great. This is exactly what I needed. I needed to not get wrecked by the, the, the bot here, which we've managed to apart from that one turn uh, way back when. And the the blue and red players seem to be fighting each other, if I had to guess. Somebody broke blue. And if they weren't fighting, then blue, was just, blue would have defended properly against the bot, right? Because the bot, what are they breaking with, like a four? Blue only had one there? Did blue fortify away and they don't care about their bonus anymore? I don't know. But this is great. Let, let them fight. Let them fight. I'll sit back, I'll chill, the bottle card trade, and since I'll be stacking so heavily here, hopefully the bot will do a lot of damage over on you guys instead, breaking you guys. And you've got a three-point hold, you've got a four-point hold. Bot might be back here, I don't know. We're chilling. The bot is my minion at this point. It does my bidding. Another card trade on five. Do I even go for the kill? Do I go for kill here? I've got so much. 43 is such a big stack. What if somebody's weak for the kill here? But, like... I'm holding so much more. It's 69. It's such a big kill stack, though. What if... But I have to go through the bots. Mm, we go for it. We go for the... We go, we go for Blue, who is looking like a terrifying little threat. No, path it properly. Hit this. Hit this. I think we can get Blue here. Be good. You over here, they've been fighting over here. Blue, possibly antagonist here. There we go. We get the kill on blue. We love that. We're doing great. Everything's turned out C, G over here. We go for red next. They've been red next. Red neck. Ooh, attacker's bonus. 
Attacker's bonus was huge. Even if we didn't win that, I still had car trade, right? Is a bot kill guarding you over here? Uh, yep, yeah, they were, and there we go! <laughs> That's the two of you in a car trade afterwards. Triple elimination, because we take these risks. If I had bad dice there, that would have gone differently. But we had good dice for here. This over here. What a beautiful turn to end it on. Even if we had lost at 25 beat 25, I still think the fact that I had four cards and Red only had uh, two puts me in a position to probably like 99% chance still beat them. But because good dice, we get it all in one single turn instead of drawing it out. And there it is. You'll love to see it. Now I have plenty more videos you can watch too. See you next time. Unless you want to see the ranks. Intermediate, beginner, beginner, novice. I think red is probably better than beginner, but they don't like sweat for rank. But there it is. Love to see it. See you next time.